Thimbleweed Park. So the game's called. All right. And yeah, yeah, we're back. Seems Probably. like the mail Whatever. should have arrived by now. I know, I know the mail's here. I want to look around. It's a mansion, okay? Look at the mansion. You nerd, please. Oh, Dolores, Dolores, Dolores. How many times have I told you not to touch my things? But as soon as you've taken over the pillow Whoa. factory, they're all yours to do with as you wish. That was a weird audio thing. It was like a way... He sounded away, but then he just moved it like a foot and he sounded close. Hell, I'll take this. You gotta take everything that's not bolted down. He's a work of art. Oh. I'm looking forward to playing chess with him. What? What the hell? It's a whip made out of network cables. The label says it's called Cat 509 Tales, produced by getdigital.eu. I guess Uncle Chuck was an impatient system admin back in the day. Wow. If it weren't for Violent. my monthly computer magazine, being Please. here would totally suck. Please shut up. <laughs> My dear Dolores, I know how you like to use my equipment. And you may use it all you want as soon as you've taken over the pillow factory. Hello, my favorite niece. How old is she? She seems like she's just a teenager. You should be nicer to my father. He just wants to help. Franklin is well-meaning, I will give you that. But he just doesn't have the same passion and vision for pillows that you and I have. Hmm. I just wanted to say how much I love you, Uncle Chuck. <laughs> I love you too, she can't Dolores. Bear to say it. I can't wait for you to take over the pillow factory and restore the family heritage. Hello, my favorite niece. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I see. If I if I click any of these, she's just gonna be like, eh, never mind. I just wanted to say how much I love you, yep. Uncle Chuck. Same thing she said I before. I love you too, Dolores. I can't wait for you to take over the pillow factory and restore yep. the family heritage. Is there like a skip Seems dialogue like the option? mail should have arrived by now. I get it, okay? You don't need to remind me. <laughs> Dolores, you know I can't work in the dark. Please turn the lights back on. No. After you've taken over the pillow Whoa. factory, you can turn off the lights all you like. What? Speak up. All right, all right, I'll go. It's funny it just happened in order to go through that door. Seems like the mail should have arrived by now. Hope you can't hear that siren. You probably can though. Wee. Wait, what's what's out here? Oh, all right. I wonder if we're just if we're gonna like keep going back to these characters, uh, the clown. There's and, uh, a sign there. Better read it first. And the uh. And, and Sorry, this, Dolores, this I had to witness that. I'm right here. What do you? <laughs> you not see me? Hello. I'm Dolores, right? It says out of order. The sign says this the sign this the sign says it's out of order. This is the sign says 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 Wow. Right, can I just look at any of these? Oh. Oh, nice. Oh my god, that's awesome! What the heck? There's like so much, so many, uh, you can just. Whoa, I wanna see that. This How is eat depressing. Chicken. Let's see. How, how to eat. How to eat chicken. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there we go. By Miguel Sands. 
I wonder if the poster was just when I saw it the first time. What if I just had just like went past it? This is a revolutionary guide about how to eat chicken. Here are the 10 steps to be followed. 1. Buy a female chicken. 2. Buy a male chicken. 3. Bring them together in your farmyard. 4. Wait until you see an egg. 5. Keep waiting. Don't be impatient. 6. After 21 days, you will have a new chicken. 7. Feed the baby chicken. 8. Look after the baby chicken. 9. Love the baby chicken. 10. Eat it when it's grown up. Caution. Don't follow the steps if you are vegetarian or allergic to chicken. Nor do it if you are a chicken. It would be cannibalism. Okay. I mean... Yeah, alright. I mean, that's a book. <laughs> Why not plush toys? These seem like all... Uh, food ones. Oh my god, lasagna? Garfield would love that. I gotta see that. Lasagna. I won't look at too many of these. Damon Nova. Right. Carrots. And... This is like a, a vegetable lasagna. I think. Yeah, no meat in this. My grandmother... My grandma, my meme, uh, made a... Made a lasagna last time I visited her and she put carrots in it. Because she didn't have anything else to put in it. And it was actually really good. It seemed like a filler, but it was like weird and it was crunchy, but it was like, it was good. Dang, these are so many books. My first login. All right, I swear, this will be the last one I look at. I don't want to waste too much time, but these are, these are really, I might, I might just go, go back and uh, look at, I should look at all these one, one day. Off camera. If I'm able to, I don't, I don't know. If it weren't for my monthly computer. And I'll lose. Uh, testament to you. This is like uh, caught in the middle of a. All right, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna read one. I'm gonna read one more out loud. How to scam your pet? Oh, what does it say? Monkey, monkey maze. Not monkey island. Planet Penumbra, Porch Chrono, Sammy sucks. Some dream, the road we made, nearly departed, all work and no play. There's gotta be a perfect one to read right here, somewhere. What did that say? Lamb, madman, or genius? Death comes too soon. Judge your execution. There's so many. How are there so many? I guess this must have been like a cheap backing price for, for, for the for the for the for the books. I mean, the clicking game. That seems right. If it weren't for my monthly computer magazine, the clicking game by Jordan O'Neill. Oh, this is kind of long. All right. She pulled a book from the shelf and opened it at random. Suddenly, she felt like she was being watched. That someone was looking over her shoulder. Was that their breath on the back of her neck, whispering the words from the page? A shiver started down her spine. She froze. She was too scared to turn around. Scared in case there was someone there. Scared in case there wasn't. She had to concentrate. What was she doing in the library anyway? She'd been too impulsive. Stupid. Now her own breath was getting shallow, her heart beating in her chest. And then she realized. The clicking sound. Ever since she I thought it would be funny if I just, like, was clicking as uh, I was reading. You know, uh, but that just closed the book. So, anyway, <laughs> should I, no, I'll continue. <laughs> then she realized the clicking sound. Ever since she'd started hearing that distant click, she'd been acting without thinking. Click. Why hadn't she noticed it before? Click. It was like the dripping of a tap. Click. No, it was like water torture. She'd been acting out of character, going around in circles, collecting strange items for reasons she didn't understand, talking to herself. Was she under some spell, some form of hypnosis? Click. What if it was all inside her head? I, I'm glad I chose that book, because especially because I was talking about it being self-referential earlier. That's perfect. Perfect. Thank you, whoever wrote that book. I said it a minute ago. Uh, instead of finding it, I'll just put the clip of me saying it again right here. Jordan O'Neill. Wait, I should Seems talk to like him. like the mail should have arrived by now. I know, I'm argument. doing stuff, okay? Jeez, get on my back, Mom. Alright. Talk to Franklin. Uncle Chuck never should have talked to you like that. He's right. My idea was worthless. I'm worthless. 
Dad, I don't like to see you like this. I liked your idea for the pillow factory. Yeah. Chuck thought it was a bad idea, and he's right. No. He's never even read it. Read what? His idea? You need more confidence, and stop letting Uncle Chuck push you around. Thanks, Uncle Dolores. Buck. You're a great daughter. But Chuck knows what is best for the factory. Hi, Dad. I love you. Goodbye, Dolores. I wonder if he's still alive. Chuck's dead. Hopefully he's still alive. I think his stuffed animals are cool. I love stuffed animals. Ice cream! The ice cream! Alright, um... An ice cream truck. Uh, drove by, drove by, but I was, I didn't, I didn't get to it on time. So, I guess I'll continue with no ice cream. What's through here? Oh, it's the kitchen. You know, for such a large mansion, they sure do have a small kitchen. I wonder if there's a hamster inside. Oh, I know. I don't have time to eat pie right now. Even no. though it looks great. No, no, not not eat pie. Use pie with Michael. I don't have time to eat pie right now. All right, forget even it. Even though it. it looks great. Forget it. Seems like the mail should have arrived by now. Please shut up. I like you. I like your character. Shut up. Huh? <laughs> oh, I couldn't sneeze again. Dang it. I'll just pick up all this stuff. Carefully handling broken glass. Hot sauce. Use hot I'm sauce. I'm not going to drink from something without reading the label. It says hot sauce. What are you talking about? Flask of Extreme Chili Sauce by Brian H.J. Comes with a warning. You might breathe fire. Maybe I should be careful with this. I think I'll just be careful with them. That's good enough for Why now. Why can't I combine stuff, man? All right, whatever. Pick up lettuce. We're just taking everything out of the fridge. Pick up <laughs> can of non-trademark infringing poopsie. What is this? A game I was about to reference, but then uh, changed my mind. Uh, pick, pick up cheese. Nice looking cheese. Batteries that are in the fridge for some reason. Use faucet. And leave it running. And then when I come back to this place in the future, it'll it still be running. If it weren't for my monthly computer magazine, being here would totally suck. I know it's bad to leave. Don't leave the faucet running in real life, kids, okay? You hear me? Also, maybe don't watch my series, because I swear. I mean, if you're like a kid watching them. There's nothing inside. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna leave that running, and then if I come back here in the game, <clears throat> in the future, it's already closed. Seems it'll still like be the running. mail should have arrived by now. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. This clock looks vaguely familiar. Maybe more highly rendered and smoother pendulum action. What? I don't know. What is it a reference to something? Oh, there's definitely a secret passage here. I can't open that. Come on, yeah you can. Don't lie. I wonder if there's like a book you can pull in the library. Oh man, oh, oh, there totally is. Oh, that's the kitchen. She's not gonna shut up about. I, all right, I got. I gotta get the the magazine because she's not gonna shut up. There's probably like a bunch of stuff I need to do, and then I'm just I'm not even doing the first thing first. What did it say again? Uh, right. Alright. Uh, yeah, alright, so I'll just 
go get this magazine now. Not. I should check the mailbox for my computer magazine. I was trying to make a cool transition to the next episode. So shut up. Right, I was gonna pretend to get it and then. Whatever. Next time. Bye.